Hi, this is Suze Love and Tarot. <clears throat> Capricorn, I think I skipped your reading. Okay, so I'm, I'm doing ketchup right now. <laughs> okay, all right, here we go. All right, all right, Capricorn, let's see. Ooh. Okay, listening to your inner voice. Woo, the sun. Oh my goodness. Yes. Okay, so things have been kind of dark. Things are going to lighten up, right? Okay, and here's that crocodile energy. Okay, adaptability is important to move out of any kind of shadow, right? Okay, and here is vitality. Okay, this is gonna, you're gonna feel charged and ready to do things. Okay, all right, so here is Lotus. Okay, vitality and opening. Okay, so a lot to be happy about, right? With all the seeds that you're planting here. And I feel like you're having a personal transformation. Okay, now this came out for a lot of people. Okay, to this lotus. It's like a whole new world. Okay, now let's see. Let's take a community card here. Okay, test the job market. Whether you love your current job or are ready for a new challenge, it's a good idea to keep an eye on the job market. By applying for jobs, you can find out how marketable your skills are, learn the going salary rates, and then gain a sense of career security. Even if you love your current job, right, or even if you're a CEO, you can see what's out there, right, and that might give you a spark for your own business. Okay. So, even if you love your current job, challenge yourself and apply for a job that may seem just a little out of uh, ordinary or out of reach. You don't have to accept the job if you get it. Resolve to update your resume and apply for six jobs. Now, if you're a CEO, what you may do is look into uh, expansion. Okay. Where can I have positive growth, right? Okay. Woo, on the bottom is this. A lot of people got that. <laughs> Host a mingler party. Build your friend community by hosting a mingler party. Okay, so, all right, so what is that? Hold on. Okay, so with that Pluto uh, exchange, I feel like a lot of you are going like, up leveling right and sometimes when you change your energy what happens is uh, people who've been harnessing those kinds of energies you've already like recalibrated so it's like becomes not an energetic match sometimes okay so or it could be a big learning curve and in that case there may have been uh, uh, not connecting, right? Choosing not to and moving forward. Okay, so with that, you can make space for new friends. And here we go. Build your friend. <clears throat> Excuse me. I had a frog. <laughs> frog in my throat. Build your friend community by hosting a mingler party. Okay, invite. Okay, so where have you been maybe... Uh, not flexible, right? Okay, and then move in flexibility. Okay, ask your bestie to help organize and co-host to make a team event. Okay, to expand your friend circle. Okay, if you are nervous about making small talk with strangers, make a mental list of few conversation topics that you can use when the conversation slows down or plan some activities or games. Sometimes it's nice that even the silence, right, is nice. I enjoy that. Okay. All right. So host a mingler party and ask them to bring someone you don't know, right? 
you've never met before. Okay, that's I like that one. Ooh, develop emotional resilience. Emotional resilience is the ability to adapt to stressful situations or crisis. Ooh, we all need this, right? Emotionally resilient people are better able to adapt to change and don't suffer as many of the damaging effects of stress. Okay, so 